The first session of the 13th Synod of the Anglican Diocese of Oka has commenced with arrival service at the host church St. Peter's Anglican Church, Agulu, an ultra council area of Anambra State. The Synod, which will last four days, is being hosted by Agulu Anglican community, comprising all the parishes in Agulu and on the Lake Archdeaconries. The theme of the Synod is Running the Christian Race, Implication for the Family in Perilous Time. Amaka Chubuzokoye tells us more. It is attracting over 700 delegates and Anglican faithful from far and near who are felicitating with Ndi Agolo and Oka Diocese on the Synod. The Synod is also witnessing the presence of many bishops and archbishops of dioceses and provinces in the Church of Nigeria who joined presidents of the Synod and Bishop of Oka Diocese, Most Reverend Alexander Ibezim and his wife, Mrs. Mata Ibezim, while welcoming the delegates and participants to the Synod. Most Reverend and Dibezim said Synod is program geared towards the promotion of the gospel of Jesus Christ and an opportunity to enjoy a fellowship with Christ that is worth more than money, silver and gold. This is our 13th year. And over these 13 years, when you look around, it looks as if we have stayed 20 years, 20 something years. I want God to come through you. I don't know how to thank all of you. In a sermon, the guest preacher, Right Reverend Stanley Fube, who is the bishop, Diocese of Lantan, Plateau State, maintained that the theme of the synod was carefully chosen to address the ills but veiling the society and told the delegates that as Christians, they should be salt and light that outshine darkness and live in a way that people will testify that they are children of God. Can you give an example that when people see you, they will know? Archbishop Ibezim, in company of the Dean, Church of Nigeria, Anglican Communion, Most Reverend Buba Lamido, other archbishops and bishops and, and clergymen, later paid a courtesy visit to the traditional ruler of Agolo, Igwe Innocent Obodako, where he prayed and asked God to bless the land and its inhabitants. In his response, Igwe Obudako said he was elated that Agulu is hosting the Synod as the community has benefited much of God's blessings and mercy, praying that this year's Synod will usher in long life, peace, progress, and prosperity in the community. This year's Synod marks the third time that Agulu Anglican community will be hosting the Synod since the creation of Oka Anglican Diocese in 1987. Planting of Synod tree by the Archbishop and his wife and an inspection of guard of honor mounted by the girls and boys brigade of the diocese marked the high point of the first day of the synod amaka chibuzo okoye abs news